Welcome to another Securing the Stack episode. I'm Zach Roof, and in this episode, we're really going to be continuing our injection fundamentals journey, so to speak. And specifically, we're going to be looking and answering the question, what is SSRF? Hmm, I wonder. Let's check it out. All right, so who is this episode for? Really, it's for developers who have novice injection or just security knowledge in general. Prerequisites, right? Check out the short link on the screen or go to it, uh, click on it within the show notes. Basically here I'm introducing the knowledge dependency tree that you can quickly identify any gaps within your knowledge. Uh, so yeah, we can get onboarded and continue on this journey together, okay? So, all right, so what can you expect from me? All right, well, at the end of this episode, you'll be able to see how server-side request forgery works through a live example basically going to be going on a scavenger hunt, uh, injecting a local Docker container and finding a sensitive file. It's going to be great. And also understand how your code coupled with the deployment environment can create semantic injection risks. We'll be learning about what semantic injection is versus syntactic injection, which we learned about in a previous episode as well. Okay. And also we're going to be reviewing blind injection through a real vulnerability within New Relic. And also, through blind injection, we're going to really learn why we focus on input validation as opposed to output validation. Uh, so basically here, we're creating a mental model, or uh, building upon our mental model just for injection and mitigation strategies that we're going to be looking at into the future. Okay, and some of these mitigation strategies uh, that we're going to be building a foundation for is going to be whitelisting. Okay, so are you ready? Come join me in the next lecture. I'm super excited for this. Let's do this.